The Rangers have Henrik Lundqvist to thank for keeping them alive with this Game 4 win in front of their raucous crowd at Madison Square Garden. Um, it was the Henrik Lundqvist show. He was absolutely spectacular, making uh, 40 saves in the win over the Kings. He's been unstoppable in the elimination games, particularly at home. He's won the last eight at Madison Square Garden on home ice, and his GAA in those eight games has been under one. The Rangers, especially in the third period when they were outshot something like 15 to 1, really have their goalie, their backbone, as Rick Nash said after the game, to thank for, for giving them this win. This game was the first step towards uh, what could become an epic comeback, but the Rangers still have a long way to go. Um, they're really going to have to generate way more offense, especially late in the game. They were caught on their heels and just chasing L.A., who was just absolutely dominant and had a lot of chances. I mean, there were tw two instances in this game where the puck was literally on the goal line, but they're still going to have to keep pressing. To force a game six, the Rangers are really going to have to take this one game at a time. You know, this is what it is. It's very cliche to say, but I think Rick Nash said right after the game that, you know, if you look at the first three games, they were probably looking a little bit too much at the big picture, thinking about what it is that they're playing for. Um, I think that they were a little bit blinded by the glare of the Stanley Cup and they might have gotten ahead of themselves a little bit. But tonight, because they had no choice, it was just take this one game, take this one win. They came out with it, though, you know, on paper, you would say that L.A. probably deserved this win a little bit more. But regardless, uh, New York at least avoided utter humiliation of a sweep. So they go back to L.A. Uh, with hopes of keeping it alive and bringing it back here to Madison Square Garden. From Madison Square Garden, I'm Sarah Kwok for SI.com.